The Tee Off Season is brought to you by Molson Canadian 67. Official beer sponsor of the RBC Canadian Open. On this episode of Molson Canadian 67's Tee Off Season, 2012 Grey Cup MVP Chad Cackert matches up against Argo teammate Swayze Waters at the Country Club. Welcome to Molson Canadian 67's Tee Off Season. I'm Scotty Willits. Now today, we're at the beautiful Country Club in Woodbridge, and we have two Argos who have arguably the best names in all of pro football. To the left of me, your 2012 Grey Cup MVP, Chad Kackert. And to the right of me, the John Agro winner from 2014, Swayze Waters. Now today's a little different. Instead of a three-hole match play, we're gonna be spicing it up a little bit, spruce it up a little bit. We're actually gonna do a three-club match play. Fellas, whose idea was this? As far as we know, it's your idea. Yeah, okay, okay. I'll, I'll take the blame for this. I'm, I'm assuming that you guys are good golfers if you're very, you know, believing or very confident in using one club. You feel, feeling that way, Swayze? We go a lot. Okay. I wouldn't say we're good. Okay, so we're gonna see how good they really are and how much practice really comes into play. Uh, who's picking the first club for today's first hole? That would be me. Okay, what are you, what are you thinking? I'm not sure, I gotta shoot the distance here and, uh, and see what we're working with and then, uh, and then we'll make a decision. He's kind of like a half caddy, half player. He's got everything, all, all, it's all thought out. All right, well when you pick your club, we're ready to go and you're gonna start us off. Yes sir. Let's do this. Since we're having a little fun today, we got a distance of 123, but we're gonna make it a little more challenging, use a six iron. Uh-oh. Starting off nice and easy. That'll work. That's looking pretty good on the fringe. Good work. Smooth. Easy does it. We're gonna have a little bit of trouble, a little bit on the slope here. Whoa, ball. Whoa, ball. Whoa! That could still be going. Yeah. Whoa, ball. Whoa. God, these six irons are just, man, really comes off the club. A little back and forth, a little back and forth. Wow. Oh wow, no he didn't. Oh, no wow. he didn't. Oh wow. Playing with only one club per hole isn't easy, but Kackert looks like a pro out there. Meanwhile, Swayze Waters needs to drain this putt for the tie. Jeez. No touch. And no touch. I'll give you a stroke if you chip it in. Mmm. Ooh. Alright, alright. No gimmies around here. <laughs> Come on now. And there it is. Chad bears down and takes the first hole. Chad looked like a professional out there with a solid bogey taking the first hole. You also picked the club, the six, uh, a six iron. What was the choice behind that? Why was that? Typically when I get into trouble, which is a lot, I use my six to get out of trouble. And so uh, I have a little more experience playing that out of a sticky situation. So I was able to make an adjustment there with the, uh, the speed. Sound like a professional over here. He's taking it very seriously. Um, it's up to you to pick your next club for this next hole. Um, what are you thinking? And are you gonna use the finger this time when it comes to the putting? Uh, I haven't seen the finger work very often for long time. So this is what I usually do. We got some, I don't know if it's water or just some fescue stuff down here. Yeah, we got a little creek down. So we're gonna tee it up and go with the three wood here. 126 <laughs> yards. <laughs> I think I got him. Just to confirm, it's 104 yards. There we go, 104 <laughs> yards. Hey, chicks dig the long ball, right? Let's get it, boys. Here we go. Swayze, you're up first. Let's go. Wow. I'm kind of amazed. That's all right. That's all right. Well done. Well done. Pressure is on. Oh! Wow. You got to give Waters credit as his drive was nice and landed just off the green. Oh, oh yeah! Oh. Get out of here! Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Woo! We got an eye on it. <laughs> Timber! Yeah, I don't know if you can hear me or not because the water's so loud, but this is the river that Cack hit his ball in. Not sure what he was thinking. Um, we're gonna have to talk to the officials. I'm pretty sure the drop zone is gonna be back, about 50 yards back that way. So. Yeah, exactly. So we're just waiting on the officials, right? Yeah. I did see an area up here that looked like it had been spray painted and might be the designated. You have to hit your ball over the creek, though, I think. Despite dunking his ball, Cackard's drop zone shots seem to help him out just a bit. Ah! 
I'll take First it. First psych out of the day. I'm, gonna have, I'm, I'm not mad early, but I need this hole. I need this hole. Swayze Waters, ladies and gentlemen. First psych out of the day. <laughs> Pretty decent four shot there. Pretty decent. It's one of the easiest ways to get in water's head. Just call him Bud. Good luck, Bud. He's not showing it, but he's he's very irritated right now. That's gonna hurt. Okay. He's got work to do. Both guys had multiple putts just to get the ball near the hole. He's gonna leave it short. Short. Is that good? No. That is. The pressure now turns to Swayze to get his ball in the hole. Promise, he's got so much stuff running through his head right now. Boom! Solid. Good putt. Solid. Oh, <laughs> the glare. We're about to play our third and final hole here at the beautiful Country Club Golf Course here in Woodbridge. And I gotta say, I'm thoroughly impressed with both of your guys' skills. You came out strong with the first hole. You dug deep, used your three wood, put into the test and actually came out the victor here. So now you guys are playing for the third and final hole here. And I get to choose which club I think you guys should use today. Since this is the farthest part three, 150 I believe. That's right. Let's use the driver. You guys feeling confident in your driver abilities? Oh yeah. Well here's what you guys are playing for. The Molson Canadian 67 score golf tee off season trophy. Wow. You put whatever you want into there, have a little victory toast after the game. This is what it's all about here, boys. And since you guys are playing for an arrow burner driver, we're using the driver. Let's go right now. Let's do it. Get out there. Cackard's drive is solid, as he'll be able to bump this up to the green with ease. Waters! <laughs> I believe that got into his head. I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> From there, Swayze Waters needed multiple shots just to get close to the green. I'm stuck here. In a pickle, I'm gonna punch it out. Oh. It's closer to the hole. From there, Swayze Waters needed multiple shots just to get close to the green. He crushes it. Meanwhile, Kacker needed only a few shots to get to this one for the win. And the winner of your Molson Canadian 67 T off season three club match play, the winning two to one, Mr. Chad Kackerts. This is your trophy, sir. Thank you, appreciate it. Now, of course, you, you don't just get the trophy over here. The game. You get the honors of Swayze cloaking you oh. with our Molson 67 eject. Feels good, eh? Feels good. Our friends at Taylor Made have presented you with your own arrow burner for winning today. Thank you. Well done, guys. Appreciate Great sports. It.